Hello, this is Joe Pearson, the project planner for this application. This is a request to the Planning Commission for a general plan conforming determination for the acquisition of real property located directly south of the property located at 2700 Ventura Road and 901 Town Center Drive. The city is considering the acquisition of this property located directly south of 2700 Ventura Road and 901 Town Center Drive. The property to be acquired consists of a 40 foot wide California Department of Transportation or Caltrans access road totaling approximately 32,227 square feet. The project is located in the northern part of the city within the River Park area and currently consists of a road which currently provides access to an existing Caltrans stormwater facility. The project area is surrounded by development, including residential and commercial, um, with the west side being undeveloped with the Santa Clara River adjacent to it and the freeway to the south. On May 23rd, 2022, the Community Development Director approved a development design review permit for the construction of a 409,000 square foot five-story apartment building with 333 residential units and a approximately 170,000 square foot, six story centrally located parking structure with 510 residential parking spaces and a rooftop deck on a 4.23 acre site. Pursuant to the conditions of approval of this project, the property owner is required to enter into a maintenance agreement with the city of Oxnard to maintain the Caltrans access road, including the roadway, landscaping, sidewalk, utilities, and ancillary facilities in perpetuity. This agreement is required to be in place prior to the city's final acceptance of the access road from Caltrans. Both the acceptance of the access road and maintenance agreement are subject to city council approval. In addition, the Community Development Director's approval found that the residential project itself was consistent with the 2030 general plan policies, as I will discuss further later in this presentation. California Government Code Section 65402 requires that a finding of general plan conformity be made by the Planning Commission and reported to the legislative authority prior to any acquisition, disposition, vacation, or abandonment of any real publicly owned property. Specifically, the Planning Commission is to determine as to whether the location, purpose, and extent of such proposed real property transaction is in conformance with the 2030 General Plan. The access road will be reconstructed and upgraded to meet emergency utility access to the approved for apartments at River Park project, as well as the existing Oakmont Senior Living Facility, which is in compliance with the general plan policy ICS 20.10, which requires adequate emergency access and routes and generally requires that new development provide adequate emergency vehicles, access for emergency vehicles, um, and particularly firefighting equipment and evacuation routes as appropriate. In addition, the approved residential project itself, which includes the five-story wraparound building with the parking structure located in the middle. Uh, the residential project itself, again, was analyzed and found to be consistent with the 2030 general plan as, as part of each of the related permits 
and implements many of the 2030 general plan policies by promoting infill, providing for a variety of housing, ensuring adequate utilities, requiring the inclusionary housing, which is 15% for this project. Among other items which were further discussed in the staff report itself. The proposed determination simply fulfills the city's obligation under government code 6542 to find the acquisition of any real property in conformance with the 2030 general plan. Environmental impacts associated with the development of the residential project were analyzed as part of the entitlement process and the development and uses associated with that residential project were determined to be covered under the River Park EIR and subsequent addenda. Any subsequent improvements to the um, property would be separately examined in accordance with CEQA. Therefore, staff finds that this project would be exempt under CEQA. And therefore, staff recommends that the Planning Commission adopt the resolution finding that the proposed acquisition of the access road is in conformance with the City of Oxnard 2030 General Plan policies pursuant to Section 65402 of the Government Code. 